Good morning, Cassie. Good morning. What are we doing today? Oh, uh, driving forever. What are we doing right now? Showering. Yes. How did you sleep last night? Um. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't. It really wasn't sleep. It was freezing. Yeah. This is where we slept last night in this car. But. And it, it looks comfy. Have enough room. Yeah, it was very spacious, just that very was... uncomfortable. Yeah. Okay, welcome to day two of our Australian Outback adventure. <laughs> we um, made it to Mildura last night from around the Sydney Wollongong area, and then we ended up sleeping at a servo. That's the Australian term for gas station. Um, a 24-hour truck stop and we even got to shower here for free the next day so that was pretty interesting mm -hmm. um, today we are going to be headed um, towards Port Augusta and a from port. <laughs> it's a port near Adelaide and um, from there we're gonna go to Lake Eyre I believe it's called or Erie I, I don't know how to pronounce it mm -hmm. in Tata Conda Park so I'm very excited about that mm -hmm. On day two, we have now crossed the border, I believe, from New South Wales into Victoria. And we have entered what looks like just desert, and there is nothing but roads for miles and miles. Things. Do we have any fresh fruit or no. vegetables? No. We right. just have salsa. Like salsa dip? Dip? No, that's fine. Okay. No. <laughs> Alright, we just required to quickly check your glove box and in the back. Have you got, you wouldn't have fridge or eskies on board? We do have an esky, but it's only filled with water. Alright, I need yeah. to have a quick look at that. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, is the back unlocked? Uh, yes. Yeah. Should be. It's All so good. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. Have a great day. You have a good day too. Thank, Thank you. Bye. We are almost two days into our trip now. We've driven 3,800 kilometers almost. Um, we are in the middle of literally nowhere. So we found some sheep uh -huh. and we're gonna try to pet them. Oh my god! Where'd they go? What? Should we go try to find them? Oh, they're literally running. They're running away from us too? Ma! <laughs> I think I'm gonna die. Ma! Ma! Oh, come back! Ma! Wait, what the f is that? Do you 
you see that? What? That thing. What is that? Hey, be really careful. If you see a snake, run. Yeah. Right. What? baby kangaroo yeah the sheep ran away from us <laughs> it, it was not it wasn't working out for us so instead we changed outfits and had a really awesome photo shoot in the middle of the desert oh okay, so okay. legal or not legal it's legal in new york to be your first cousin no yeah Remote areas ahead, the following precautions are advised. Carry adequate fuel, water, current road maps, two spare tires, two jacks, shovel, first aid kit, tool kit, ro tool, uh, tow rope, drink water at regular intervals to avoid dehydration, travel at speeds appropriate to road conditions, avoid night driving, in event of a breakdown, never leave your vehicle, do not camp in waterways. Uh, flash flood could occur. Avoid wet weather driving. Keep friends or relatives informed of your outback travel itinerary. Should we tell somebody we're here? How? Do we have service? No. All right. Wish us luck. We're not religious, but let's start praying. Yeah. Okay. Let's do this. Somebody left a spoon right there. That is why you don't do meth and drive a car in the outback, guys. You see? Go back, go back, go back. 